Hi, I'm Tenyo Lash Shuboale. Here's your Channels TV Evening News Recap for May the 1st, 2021. The Nigerian Labour Congress is threatening mass industrial action if the proposed bill, which seeks to transfer minimum wage to the concurrent list, is passed by the National Assembly. NLC President Ayuba Waba also says workers in Kaduna will withdraw their services for five days in protest over the sacking of workers by the state governor, adding that there will be a total shutdown if the workers are not reinstated. Mr. Bawaba was speaking during a rally at the Eagle Square in the nation's capital, Abuja, to mark Labor Day. The chairman of the People's Democratic Party's Governors Forum, Governor Aminu Tambua of Sokoto State, is asking the federal government to speedily decentralize the nation's security structure and also strengthen consultations with former servicemen in order to find lasting solutions to the country's security problem. Governor Tambua stated this at the PDP National Caucus meeting held in Abuja. While Nigerians are marking Workers' Day, efforts towards resolving many national questions have been at the centre of this course at the 15th edition of the Platform Nigeria. The convener of the event, senior pastor of the Covenant Nation, is asking everyone to get engaged with the issues of governance to achieve the change that all Nigerians desire for the nation. On the international scene, the United States has started formally withdrawing troops from Afghanistan, beginning the end of what President Joe Biden called the forever war. The US and NATO have had a presence in Afghanistan for almost 20 years. And to sport, Manchester City are on the brink of clinching the Premier League title after a 2-0 win against Crystal Palace. Pep Guardiola's side moved 13 points clear at the top thanks to second-half goals from Sergio Aguero and Ferran Torres at Selhurs Park. City will be crowned English champions for the third time in four seasons if second-placed Manchester United lose at home to Liverpool on Sunday. And that's the Evening News Recap. Don't forget to join us tomorrow for the morning update. I'm Tenyo Lash Shubo Ali. Thanks for watching.